rock band so I'm gonna do a bad Australian. Yeast dicks, I am dancing. Oh god, that was Texan. I'm the worst at accents. Really just it's English, to tell it's us English how slash talking. So, so imagine he makes one of them all the time. That'll be basically me just stop talking for him. Yeah. Well, it was already accepted and paid for, so. I probably bad actor that they have. You can call me Dr. Kim, that, that is my actual name. And maybe we should just go with I will put, pull up a Cockney accent as soon as this so lovely song is like done. Stay on target! Red Onion standing Sorry, by. Sorry, I just read this and maybe you'll accidentally. Talking. Red Velvet standing by. Red Kev standing by. This is good music, right? It's a challenge. There, there, there's a second compartment if you want to go in. Yeah, 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 yeah. This is the front door on the right. Yeah. The creepy doll is the front door. I hope they posted those entries. I never yeah, saw them. Yeah, it goes in the left cave, you can go into the right cave. Yeah, cool. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. Kathleen picked really rock music. Huh? Oh, I picked right, right music. I am a music aficionado. Yeah, it's totally Australian what I'm doing, but that's yeah. okay. Right, right, right. Oh. Good dancing, Brett. Uh, okay, Zayla Rico, you keep petitioning us to tell Mike Lunsford to, to what's put on his poster. We don't actually tell him what to do. He decides what he wants to put on the poster himself. Indeed. And he makes us all go, wow, bitch. So, so is this is this supposed to be is this supposed to be a fifteen minute uh, challenge or are we supposed to yes yeah. oh so so the so entire fifteen minutes we 15 have to talk minutes, like this yeah. plus it's not too hard it's not too hard right Jamie's going to come in and be completely surprised yes I mean he'll have to do his best right. Right. Shh, shh, shh. Brit. oh James Brit quiet saved my life. We are, you want to take over? This is Bob Hoskins, who is apparently a cockney. Oh, uh, what what auction ended up getting the Top Gear, folks? It was the Atlas. It was the Atlas auction we did earlier tonight, <laughs> and uh, I was James May, and I didn't have a lot to say, but uh, but we had uh, Alex dressed in the Good medieval mom, mom, helmet, and he was the Stig's medieval cousin. You Stig. Yes, you right. old Stig. So this is Brit. This is this is this is a cockney Brit. No, when I came into this game, they said, oh, you, you know, you're going to have to have drama lessons, right? you know, so you're going to have to learn to speak properly and walk properly. Then speak properly. Act properly. And I thought, I thought, well, I'm going to speak like I don't, walk like I don't, speak <laughs> like I'm not. So you just got to talk like this I'm guy for the next 15 minutes. minutes. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Bob Hoskins. Bob Hoskins. Bob Hoskins is a Cockney accident. Uh, no idea. Apparently he's Cockney, yeah. That's crazy. You know, it does not matter what you put on, I cannot do accents. What well, about no, That's, that's, that's not true. Shame. You can do that Russian accent. Uh, yeah, I, I, I can talk in... Uh, beer can. Beer can. Beer can. Beer can. Beer can. Beer can. Oh, that's interesting. That's right. We, we bartered that one down for ten minutes. That's correct. Oh, so it's only 10 minutes, Only oh, 10 minutes, that's right, we oh, right. it down. So, fish we, and cheats. This is where I lay shared about about uh, nine minutes, <laughs> starting very soon. The chat well, is we've, saying... We've all been doing this for like four minutes Africa. now. Africa! Oh. All right. The, the chat Africa! Is, the chat is saying I sound, I sound like a New Zealander, and that might be because... <laughs> she is, in fact... I, I'm, <laughs> I'm from New Zealand, and I can't do accents very well. well just so let I, her. I sort of default. Uh, uh, default. We'll just let you do your normal default. accent then. Yeah. Default. Mm. Yeah, did, you, did you find that you had it for a while and then you lost it? I, I did. Uh, I did, because when I moved to Canada, <laughs> uh, I got a lot of uh, uh, teasing for saying things like, where's the rubbish bin? So I... What rubbish? Uh, I had to lose the accent quickly to, to fit in. Are you finding it hard well, to actually maintain it right now? Yeah, it's because I'm thinking about it. Oh. Actually, hold on. That's terrible. Hold well, on. Wait. Hold you on. see, hold we on. have two more challenges that have not yet been paid for by Accepted and no other pending ones. One second. So, oh. The, I, I can, went on oh, one, just a bit. Left, 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 left. When, Jeez. thank you. When I, when I read something, I can actually do the accent really well because I'm not concentrating on it. <laughs> 
so I can. So I brought a bad novel to read from. This is like a bad erotic fiction written by no. Nina Bangs. Oh, excellent! Right, that's what we're in the mood for right now. Yes, it is Team Zeta time. You yes. realize? T Team Zeta. I'm going to have a cap off the captain's chair. I sound South African. My over here. The gods of the night are hunting for no, you, Mr. What? Wyatt. You're they know that you're recruiting. The vampire mm. laughed. Gods of the night? Who came with a dumbass name like that? The dumbass who leads us chose that name, Lee. He had a flair with a dramatic. Oh no, this is too bad to even read in a bad accent. How many minutes left of this accent thing do we have? This has got five minutes and thirty seconds. Jesus! This is terrible. I'm just going to shut up. <laughs> and then the chat will explode with a bunch of questions for Kathleen at this point. Yes. You know what was really gratifying for me is that. As, as we were upstairs one time, I was talking with Jamie, and as we were having a conversation, uh, he said something that was just really funny, it was very precise and very specific, and I just loved it, and I repeated it, I says, that was so wonderful, because you said, oh, I this, this, and this, that, and I says, it was just so beautifully precise, he says, you do a very good English accent, which is very gratifying for me, because when I was in high school, I did an English accent one time for this girl who did an incredibly over-the-top English accent that was completely ridiculous. She's like, you're not very good at accents. And I'm like, oh, uh, I guess I'll never do an accent again. <laughs> but it's kind of nice to know that, that somebody else, somebody who actually speaks a language, thinks that I sound like I could pass. Oh, Scottish, Kathleen. I'm that close. No, like, I cannot do Scottish. That's fantastic. Thank you, sweet sir. I just want to show the one I think is the... It's actually, it's, it's not too hard to do this, but I can't hear myself, so... Uh, because I've got the headphones on. Oh! Not Alex! Team Zeta is waning. So, uh, I'll be back. Have Good a sleep. Night. We begin morning shift. Not in eight or ten hours, so... Best of luck. Cheerio. Pippin. All that. All that jazz. Cheerio. All that. Later, Governor. Have you tried Irish? Good morning, Alex. <laughs> The work with daddy here. Uh, <laughs> work with daddy. Oh. You, do not put, do not take off your pants in public. Leave your pants on. The work with daddy here. That's the only thing I can do with an Irish accent. All right. Should so, I retell the work with daddy story? Here's the desert, the desert quap. <laughs> Ooh. I nice. think this is the funniest of them, even though it's not directly. Really? Oh, it's Wait, animated. It goes on. Oh, fantastic. <laughs> <laughs> that. You know, the, what would have made oh. that what made that funnier is if it had moved forward slightly and then flipped Flip in the back air backwards. That's, that's pretty there, good. There are some good arts, but that one made me made me chortle. I think they win the desert. And and the name was Daniel. It was they actually did use a screenshot. Oh, did they? Yeah, they did. So who who won that? Uh, who? I, I, yeah. I really who didn't that? like that other art we saw earlier. I want to see all of them. Uh, yeah, I'll see if I will. Uh, who oh, submitted that one? That was by... Oh, I have to ask King Cool. In a moment, huh? All right. Oh. Apparently my attempt at Scottish was close to Irish, so go with that. <laughs> Jeez. Accents, not, not a talent. Um, not a, not a talent. We could try to put it on the monitor. The problem is, is that uh, I don't have direct access to it, so um, it will go up on the blog. You'll be able to read it there. Uh, could we announce the winner of that, though? Oh, indeed. Do we have the name? I, just funny, uh, it's okay. okay. We're going to get the name uh, for you. We'll let you know. Apparently, Kitsuta is saying it's hers. Yeah. Anyone in the new... Yes. Uh, isn't, isn't Neil Gaiman... Uh, isn't he Welsh? I no. thought somebody mentioned he was Welsh. So you could try to just sound like Neil Gaiman. Jinsipa. Which would probably attract a lot of women. <laughs> Even though we just talked to him, I can't remember. That's no, exactly. Actually, I when I was uh, when I was uh, initiated into Freemasonry, this sounds really ridiculous, but when I was initiated into Freemasonry, the man who was doing it uh, was Welsh, and I had never heard a Welsh accent before. So when we were going through the initiation, I'm trying to follow along with what, everything that he's saying because it's extremely important to listen to what's going on. I couldn't understand half of what he was saying. <laughs> Which is terrible because I'm supposed to repeat things back, so I'm having people whisper things in my ear like, he just said this. I'm like, oh, right, okay. <laughs> now I've just re revealed an amazing secret about myself. There, that is my $5 fact. Beach is a Freemason. Beach is a Mason. That's a great fact. Are you allowed to actually reveal that? Oh, yeah, you will. It's always up to you, right? You can say whatever you want. The only thing is, is that there's certain things that I can't reveal about the craft. Um, I can't reveal, for example, 
Um, we, we have secret handshakes that actually exist, but I can't show anybody what they are. The it's the that thing where you grab their ankle and tug, oh. isn't it? Well, I, I can neither confirm nor deny whether we grab each other's ankles. The ankles. All right, but, so the winner uh, is Victoria with your desert co-op gift. Okay, Victoria, I'm going to have to drop the accent for this. Could you please email prize at desertbus.org? Andre, could you do me a favor? Because yeah. I'm the only one here. Could you write down... Does yeah, Victoria... Paul's not actually here. <laughs> Um, could you write down the, the, those two lots, and could you, uh, if Victoria has a donor ID, or at least her email address, or something like that, yeah. Yeah. and uh, that she it? won those? There should be a second one there. Victoria, oh. email prize at desertbus.org and say you won the, the, in the other one? you won the desert quap contest. Oh, it's on the document oh. camera. Hmm. I think we're done accent time anyway. I'm out. Well, I know we've got 10 seconds left, yeah, so let's get it all in. Pip, pip, yeah. chippy, oh, Roy. Who work with daddy here? Work Do with not daddy take here. off your pants mm. now. You have to leave your Can pants on. Please work with I'm daddy. I'm disabled. I'm disabled. Yes, I'm disabled. <laughs> I've just been doing Roy this whole time. Got now it's okay. Daddy. Does the yeah. chat know the work with daddy story? <laughs> I can sing a couple songs in accent, like like uh, Pogue songs, just because they're supposed oh, to be. Nice. They're, they're just because they're trying to pretend to be Shane McGowan, mm -hmm. which is also which is seen with an Irish accent and no teeth. No, yeah. Which is fairly. Oh, hey, impressive. Justin's in the chat. Okay, oh. Justin, I will tell you the extremely abbreviated story of the work with Daddy story. It's because I was in a coffee shop trying to get some work done, and a guy had come in with his daughter, and he was clearly like taking this like three-year-old girl in to a coffee shop for a couple like maybe an hour to get it out to get the kid out of his wife's hair he was Irish and the and you know the kid was being incredibly like hyperactive and stuff and was like trying to get into his tea which was very hot and then she decided that she was too hot she was trying to take off her pants the entire time she was in this coffee shop and he was getting more and more flustered and right before they left like he tapped out early right phoning his wife can we come home now uh, he was just he just you know was very very pleadingly said to her Work with daddy here. Do not take off your pants in public. You must leave your pants on. Please work with daddy here. And so I am sitting across from them doing everything in my power not to burst out laughing. Uh, it's like, why is, why is that plea to a hyperactive three-year-old. It's like that's that's very funny, and but somehow it's funnier with the accent. It's like, why is it funnier with the yeah, accent? It was Who funnier because he was super Irish. That's not something we don't hear them. Oh, work with Daddy here, please. Yeah. <laughs> we should do a morning auction because we've been having really good luck with those. Okay. Uh, hey, Justin McElroy is in the chat. Should I ask the same to go dig through the files? Cool. What is it? Hey, fix twins' new single, Work with Daddy. <laughs> <laughs> it was party at Arkham Asylum? I do not know that one. Is that like from Arkham Asylum? The game? Uh. Angry Peanut is trying to bait me into a labyrinth thing. Dear, dear Desert. Kathleen, you remind me of the babe. What babe? The babe with the power. What power? The power of voodoo. 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 Do what? That's going away now. That's that's the the work with Daddy is actually the one thing I can do in an Irish accent because it's just indelibly burned into my mind as one of the funniest and saddest things I have ever seen. I think I'm going to put the deadline on my chapter 7 contest. Oh just yeah. In case there's anybody who's still around and is was writing chapter 7. We're on the, like the adventures of uh, Dangler and Butts. Dangler and Butts. Dangler, we need more Dangler and Butt chap Butts chapters. We need 10. We're at 7 if we've got entries. I'm going to go up and check in about 10 minutes. I'll call it. Ooh, a group donation to have Matt drive for a bit. Once we get into bonus time. What do you think, Paul? I think that's definitely possible. I think we should do that without telling him. <laughs> no, we can't start accepting challenges without telling people. That breaks the whole system. If we do it, then they can do it. Ah. All right. Accepting challenges for us. And then then who knows where it leads. Then you're do, we have, uh, do we have any more challenges we can do, or should we reopen them? We are bit? currently, uh, uh, I believe, let me just refresh this. But I think... Well, let me just go down the list here. I like this of the recent challenges, we're done all the ones. So let's just see if there's I'm any. I'm still had girl. Uh, and Graham. I'm not a hat. Uh, Mind blown. Crows and Ashton <laughs> sing this. Wait. But why is hat? Oh right, this oh. is the the Crows and Ashton 
popular parody that we had to tap out on. But because Crows had not it's prepared. Crows, Crows, well, Crows had, had not slept for a long time and his voice was shot. Well, I don't think that's going to get any better. Uh, synchronized walking <laughs> routine. Oh, but I need to wait to the We're going to have to do that on, like, Thursday because James <laughs> Ashley Graham.